In Starfield, players can own a number of homes, mixed between houses, apartments, and even a shipping container with a bed in it. In this guide, I'm going to list all the properties you can buy, how much they cost, how to get them, and where they are found, plus showcase each of the houses. Our first house is the Dream Home. The Dream Home is available to players at the beginning of Starfield. It's yours if you take the Dream Home trait, but you must do this during the character creation process at the start of the game. Once you choose the trait, you'll get the Dream Home quest after meeting Constellation that asks you to see Landry Hollowfield in New Atlantis about your mortgage. Track the quest and the game will guide you on how to find it. Our second apartment is the game's most expensive apartment, called the Sky Suite in Neon. You can purchase Sky Suite from Boone Morgan, the bartender at the Astral Lounge in Neon. You will have to pay 235,000 credits on the spot to purchase the Sky Suite, and once your purchase is complete, you leave the Astral Lounge and go down the stairs, then turn left and take the elevator into the Neon Trade Tower to find the Sky Suite apartment. This is your new home, an overpriced but very tiny apartment with probably the worst view imaginable. From most expensive to the cheapest house in game, the Neon Sleep Crate Apartment. You can buy the Sleep Crate from Neon for 6,500 credits. And to do this, you need to head to Ebside by taking the door to the right of the Enhanced location, where you can change your appearance in the Neon Core, and then speak with Isna Sundararamin and purchase the Sleep Crate. She's sitting at the desk at the Sleep Crate HQ. Too bad I can't squeeze any Aurora from these fish. All right, let's get back to it. Next, we have the Core Manor in Aquila City. This is bought for seven to eight thousand credits, and you can talk to Engodup Tate. He's standing in the yard of the Core Manor, which is located right beside the rock the tall building at the end of the main street. Walk towards the rock, but head up the stairs on the left and look for Tate standing outside the core manor, which has a low brick fence and you will talk to him and he will sell you the apartment. The second apartment in Aquila City is the Stretch Apartment for 45,000 credits. Again, you can purchase this from Ingoro Tate, who is next to the Core Manor, and you can simply buy the apartment and then head straight to it. Next, we have our parents' house. If you choose the kids' trait perk, you can stay at your parents' house in your childhood bedroom. This is located in the Pioneer Tower in New Atlantis Residential District. Just so you know, your mother's missed you. 
like a lot. The well apartment costs 30,000 credits. If you'd like to purchase the well apartment, you'll need to do the UC Vanguard questline initiated by talking to Commander John Tuala in the mast building in New Atlantis. Or you can pick the trait where you start off as a United Colony citizen. Once you complete the questline up to the one called Friends Like These, you'll become a United Colony citizen and will be able to purchase property in New Atlantis. Speak to Zora Sangueni from Aphelion Realty close to the mass building to buy this for 30,000. Lastly guys, we have probably the best apartment in game, the Mercury Tower Penthouse in New Atlantis. This one is free, however you're going to have to complete quests in order to get it. To begin the quest, speak to Commander John Tuala and agree to join the Vanguard. You should speak to him right after meeting the Constellation Group and getting Sarah Morgan as your companion. And while talking to him, you can agree to join the Vanguard, you can complete your training and take the oath. You will then need to complete every single UC Vanguard quest, which is a pretty long quest line and then you will eventually be rewarded with the Mercury Tower penthouse apartment as your reward. But it's definitely worth doing early, as it's the best apartment in the game. Guys, that is it for this one. Like and subscribe for more Starfield Guide videos, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.